Hello my perfume lovers, addicts, fanáticas de perfume como yo. Welcome back to another video. Hello everyone. Hope you are doing good. Thank you so much for being here. Now, what I have for you today is layering combos. Okay, so I've been really, really excited about this. I'm very new to the whole layering game. Um, so I have 10 combinations. I have 10 combos. I've tested these out. Um, some were better than others. Um, and some of them, well, I'm going to tell you where I got them from. Some are not my, um, I got them from other YouTubers and other people. Um, you know, I will give credit where it's due. Okay. But I want to share this with you guys, because if you want to try something new like me, I am, I'm recovering. So I set goals for myself in 2024. Um, that I would be buying less. So I feel like layering is a fun, it has been a fun way for me to explore and contain myself from buying more. Um, so today is the 28th of January and I'm, and I'm clean. I haven't bought any fragrances and I've had temptation. I've been on YouTube. I've been watching you all. So I'm not really helping myself, but <laughs> yeah, so I'm very proud of myself and I, but I got my list. I'm making my list of the ones that I I will be purchasing, but it's gonna be a very well thought list. Um, so I got, you know, that's for another video. We'll talk more about that. So let's get into the first one I have for you. Okay, so the first one that I have, this combo was given to me by Sunny from Sunny Sense. And this is fire, okay? This is fire. Ambrosia Imperial by Navitus and Vanilla Royale by Kayali. This combo is beautiful. You have the candy-like apple with, you know, all the, the, the yumminess. And then you have over here the vanilla and the rum and the creme brulee and just the sweetness of both of these together. And a little bit of this woodiness that you get from, from the oud that is here. I can't really tell from the oud, but it just makes it beautiful. This combo, I'm in love with it. In love, love, love with it. Okay, that's that one. The next one that I have is from Denise Adore. So if you don't watch Denise Adore, she is a big layering combo queen. So go over there and you will take some notes because that's what I was doing. So she talked about this one, Overture by Jerjoff with... Amouage Guidance. Wow. This is a banger. This is because these are both very statement type of fragrances. They are sexy. They are bold. They are not crowd pleasing. This is not for a beginner who is just trying, starting to spell fragrances. This is a woody, spicy floral. Here you have the rose and the ylang ylang and a little bit of that smokiness, woodiness. And then here you have that, um, also the the rose and the woodiness and the nuttiness and that pear in there these two is like you you're taking over you were just if you're gonna take over the day you're gonna take it over everyone this is what you wear so you gotta be ready for that it's not just like you just woke up no you gotta really know you're gonna take over that day <laughs> okay the next one that i have is this one is Libre Le Parfum, Libre Le Parfum, and Black Opium Le Parfum. So we have two YSOs, two Le Parfums. They are beautiful. I've been really loving this. As you can see where it's at, it's scary. And then this beautiful loaded vanilla. There's so many vanilla, vanillas in here. And the sweetness from this one, with the, it's beautiful. I got this actually from, her name is Melissa National. She's like a huge YouTuber. She talks more about male fragrances like cologne, but um, she did mention this combo that she tried. Um, and yeah, so I thought, I really like both of these by themselves. I This is new to me, like I said. I am I was always a person that just wore one perfume, that's it. Um, but And I thought, well, I was like, this one is so beautiful by itself. This one is so beautiful by itself. But then I wore this one by itself the other day. And I was like... I was missing the combo. I was missing the combo. It's even better. I'm telling you. Try it out. Try it out. Okay. The next combo that I have here. This is another one that uh, Denise Adore talked about. These are Alexandria fragrances. These are imitations. They are really good dupes. So what are they duping? 
Purple Haze. This is the imitation for Psychedelic Love by Initio and Dark Knight, the imitation for Black Phantom. I was afraid of this combo, I'm not going to lie. And I'm not afraid of a lot of perfume, different types of perfume. I'm very, I have a very wide variety of taste from Middle Eastern, designer, niche, uh, cel it's even some celebrities. We're going to get into that soon in my collection. Well, I've I think you already saw my part three collection if you're watching this one and then you'll see all of those my middle eastern and my celebrity fragrances if you didn't see the video go ahead go check it out and then come back here and finish this one <laughs> okay so black phantom is that dark chocolate coffee just like this is definitely a i feel like it's a winter one it does lean slightly masculine but it gets way better in the dry down um like when i was spraying this all over myself i was like yes and then purple haze is that yellow floral balsamic um woody um it's it's just when and i got compliments two compliments and the people that i work with do not wear these types of fragrances so i was very surprised i got two compliments with this combo okay so denise Adore, she knows she knows what she's talking about okay the next combo I have, well, this, I have a few here. So we're going to do first, oh, this one is my Lost Cherry Dupe, right? This is Amarena Cherry by Fragrenza. And then this is a little travel size of um, BR540, Baccarat Rouge 540. I have this one. I have a Middle Eastern one that is almost the same. Cloud is similar. Uh, so many people are like, no, it's not the same. There's like so many fragrances that are similar to the Baccarat Rouge 540 and it's not a huge difference, but I know that, well, we're not going to get into that. The thing is, this is the real thing just in case, just to show that I do have the original, even though the ones that I have are almost the same. And um, with this one, this was, um, so Lost Cherry, Baccarat Rouge 540. This combo, I'm wearing it today. This was by Abby with Love. See, she suggested this one. So it is beautiful. The BR540 with the cherry. Wonderful. Love it. Love it. Love it. Okay. Now, we're going to do a few with Lost Cherry because cherry is a, is something, Lost Cherry is something you can really layer with so many things. This is what I'm finding out. So it just really worked with almost everything. So another combo that I have is Lost Cherry with Campfire Nights, which this is a by, by the fireplace dupe. It's really good, almost exact. And then um, Lost Cherry. So by the fireplace, Lost Cherry, Tom Ford. This one I heard from Veronica, from Veronica Says. Um, and it's really, really, really good. Okay, that's another one. It's really good. Okay, that's that. And then the next cherry combo we have is Brooklyn Fragrance Lover. This is the imitation for Angel Share. I do have Angel Share. It's over there. Um, but, you know, it's smaller. I was trying to fit it over here on this little thing. So um, really good dupe. Angel Share, Lost Cherry. Boom. Don't break. <laughs> so this is a very good combo. It just... It's like the, and matter of fact, I think Dua might have one of, Dua, the um, Dua fragrances might have like one of those, um, I always forget what it's called, that they combine two scents. They might have this one, like a Lost Cherry with, uh, by the fireplace. They might have that one already, but if you don't, you could do these. Okay. That's that. Beautiful. And then we have this one. I tried this one today. Actually, I just wanted to try it just to put one more in the video. And it was, this is Princeless Princess. So this is the dupe for Killian's Princess, so Princess. And then Lost Cherry. This was beautiful. It was so creamy, yummy deliciousness. So you have like the creaminess from the from the marshmallow and all the, the lactonic stuff going on in, in Princess with the cherry. It was like a yummy, how do I say? Ch cherry, strawberry, milkshake type of thing real good okay really really good i need to do this again i need to wear it again and then we have christian siriano intimate silhouette which is really 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 similar to commodity milk bold which i love and this is a lot cheaper 
and it gives you the same you know so that with lost cherry this was also a really nice combo okay and last but not least hopefully i'm not missing anything yes last but not least i have camera by latafa with french coffee by al rehab so here you have this booziness with this whole cinnamon nutmeg dates vibe this very it's like a very airy gourmand i feel it's very hypnotizing like that kind of thing and then you have french coffee is a caramel coffee ready to drink very delicious this is pure coffee so you do have to like want to smell like a delicious coffee when you put this together i haven't tried the kawak or kwawi however you say it which is the new one that has the coffee note but i'm guessing that's probably what it would smell like or what it should have smelled like because a lot of people have said that the coffee dies down in that one and you don't really get it so yeah those are my combos i hope you like them try them out let me know what you think i love them and i'm gonna keep looking for more things to layer because this was a lot of fun so thank you everyone for watching if you haven't subscribed go ahead and subscribe we're trying to get 1k over here i i didn't want to but now i do now i do i kind of want to get to that i just don't like these uneven numbers that's just what i don't like so thank you everyone for watching until next time bye